Hey yo, what's up? Today I will be showcasing you new insane map changes that they added in the 1.20 update. So today the developers released the 1.20 beta patch notes which involves insane map changes from like these type of changes then they added even this they even added this and of course this and this and this so in today's video i'll be only uh, showcasing the map updates i will make the 1.20 beta patch now full review in another video but for now let's start with the map changes so the gameplay in the background is essentially what the game areas look currently in the 1.19 live version and later on in the video I will show these places but how they look on the 1.20 beta. Note that the 1.20 beta maps still be changed sometime in the future or something will be readjusted for the live version but currently in the beta it's insanely changed especially on raid so the first map is arctic which has all crates are now penetrable which means you can wall bang them then there's improved lighting overhaul which is actually for all of the maps next is bout low walls and other objects including the tree are now penetrable improved spawn positions and on proofy more objects are now penetrable for example the green tarps which are those green crates and revised inaccessible xperia area which is seen on this image so bureau doesn't actually have any changes but for kennel however there are some new changes to stairs that are now accessible again they changed the a and b sites they added like crates on there then on the cafe they changed the colliders with some tables and chairs which essentially means you can now basically hop on any of the tables in the cafe area and in the middle of the map right next to the car that's on the bridge they added metal sheets next to those garbage bins For cargo, they have changed the spawn areas, which means you will not be able to spawn in the middle of the map. Then for the vision, they changed the death barrier when you jump out of the vents in the middle of the map. In gallery, they changed the courtyard that resembles Legacy's courtyard even more, which essentially means you can see um, the courtyard where the B side is from Legacy now through those windows on gallery map. Then for grounded, this actually they changed on the A side some stuff. The wagons are now penetrable. Wagons is lit more to provide visibility, which means they're now brighter. And uh, they changed that on the B side. They changed on the B side that you can no longer shoot under the airplane. They also changed that on the plants no longer are collisionable, which means bullets and grenades can pass through them and you can no longer stand on those flight information screens to have like those glitch spots anymore. On the heat map, they have improved the lighting. They also removed some balconies to improve player collisions essentially. Next we have Legacy, which is a shocking one, where they remove essentially the subway from the whole map, which means you can no longer have access to the subway area, and they also change the density of some objects, and they also change the restaurant area where they blocked off the entrance to the area where the seating area is from the subway and also the entrance to the subway itself and they changed the museum hallway to bomb side A where they fixed the bomb stock positions they also changed the, stop, the stair area in the middle of the map where they really didn't change anything that much but what they also did was they extended the wall behind the stairs
Now for park, they have repositioned and changed the trees. They also have remade the unaccessible areas, which is basically the outside of the map, like for the waters, for example. Now for plaza, they have improved the lighting. They removed the balconies to improve the player collisions for some reason. And for B site, they have changed the stalls, which they essentially made the stalls be a little bit further from each other. Now, right next to where the house is of the map, underneath there was usually a car, but right now there is two of those stalls, which are like those small shopping boxes. They also added a small wall near the stairs of the map and uh, the crates are now replaced with new ones. They also removed the balconies in the corner next to the church, which is also to improve player collisions. Now in the house, they actually added a bed. Now for the port mat, they actually changed like a shape at the spawn area of the breach side. Then the reese added some changes to both of the bomb sides like they changed the boxes in it the also did some lighting effects there essentially hey you yes you listen up buddy YouTube statistics says there's about 80% of my viewers who are not subscribed and if you're one of them make sure to subscribe because you won't regret it I hope but without further ado let's continue with the video now, now for purify however they have added additional tunnels where you can essentially move in the bottom area of the map and they also have moved the A site and there are some objects also added throughout the map. Now for Raid, which is actually the last map, they have fixed a majority of the bomb stock spots. They have remade the breach pawn area. And they have also changed the A side and the B side. They have made it some extra crates there. They have made new spots to sit in. They have also changed the uh, collision spawn area to the mid entrance, which essentially is on the 1.19 version of the raid. When you spawn as the collision, you're right next to like the entrance of the raid map itself like the building and there's like that forklift and there's like some boxes there they have redesigned that area and they have made it as the collision spawn also the boiler room has been moved like the entrance to it is a bit different from the both sides and also on the belong area they have made it so you can get on top of the box that usually is there but it's only accessible from the breach side of the map Now these are some screenshots that I got while I was checking out all of the maps so here are some images that I found.
ਪਹਿਲਾਂ